Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you're looking to spice up your titles and make your video stand out, I got something really useful for you today. I put together 10 title effects that are perfect for giving your videos an extra touch and the venture resolve. They're super easy to use and you can really save up your time while editing. You can grab them right now through the link in the description below. So let's dive in and let's see how you can start using these effects in your own projects. You will receive a file that is a Dero effects which you want to double click and open in DaVinci Resolve. Click on install, click on the effects library, expand the toolbox, titles and look for MG titles. Select that and inside you will find all of the 10 text effects that I'm showing you right now. Starting off with a big follower, then there's a bounce, there's a fast beat under that. After that is the flicker, then you will find a floating text. Next is the medium follower, which is the same as the big one, just a little bit of less movement. There's a pop-up. There's also a slide one with a little bit of hold in the middle and then slide out. And there's also a small follower with a tiny bit of movement and also a text reveal at the end. All of these are very easy to use very easy to customize so let's make a simple preview with a few of them on how you can edit with them so you can just drag and drop it onto your project and in the inspector you can see that you can type there your text inside and also you can pick your font style color and adjust the color just the major things that you want to adjust on the text but also you can highlight it and select the fusion tab in order to expand the notes that i'm having grouped up there you can double click on this group note if you want and then you can see that there's four notes in there background text glow and merge one also you can select the glow for example click outside of it and then click inside again so that it's going to be available and you can see that in here you can even adjust the glowing you can increase it, decrease it, or even you can disable it if you feel like you don't need it. As I said, I kept just the most important things in the edit tab and in here it's not necessary, but you also having a chance to customize it even further. Also, you can highlight the background, increase the alpha to a values of one. That way you're having a background and by selecting the color, you can change the color of your background in here. Let's say for a red example. And you can use it as it is right now. Let's make an example with the other one. We're having a flicker. So I'm highlighting it and I'm going into the fusion page. First, I'm changing it to color green. And in here, I'm expanding the group nodes and I'm selecting the text and I'm going into the inspector, into shading. Element number two is enabled. That is our outline. Selecting the color and I'm picking black outline. That way we're leaving black stroke. I'm increasing the thickness and if you don't like the default white, you can also change it from here or also you can delete it by deselecting the enable button. And I really think they're good as they are. So you will not need to go into the fusion and further customize it, but you have that option if you wish to. So you can check out the link in the description so you can visit my store. There's also free presets in there. So make sure you get them. Thanks for watching. I hope it was helpful and see you in the next video.